I'm John Champion and analysing this game for us is Jim Begley. So let's get down to business. Gets the ball in a nice position. Well back. Now through to Rooney. Well, it's a dangerous game the defence is playing by pushing up and looking for offside. One individual lapse and the whole drill can collapse. Got it. Play surges forward. Zapora. Now Welbeck. Ebue. Ashley Cole. The forward push gains momentum. He can take the shot on here, Rooney. Tiote. Gerard. Now cleverly. The ball's with Welbeck. Going forward with purpose. Chance. They grab the opener. Find some words to do justice to that goal. Well, they just knew instinctively where the ball was going to end up. That's clearly been worked on in the training ground. The understanding is, is pretty exceptional between them. And it was beautifully worked. Gone ahead so early in the game. Cleverly. Well back. Can he now find a finish? It's taken. 
Everton with some style. They lead by two. Was that on target? We'll certainly try and claim it. He's got two in this game. He's on a hat trick. It's 2-0. Well, that goal makes such a difference to the whole dynamic of this game. That second goal puts them in control now. Now Welbeck. Welbeck has got hold of it. was a fine solo effort. Well, he knew he needed a better angle to get a shot away, and at least he showed the best option. It just didn't come off. And Drogba. Milner has a hold of him. Zakora, Yaya Toure. That'll be a throw in. Gerard. Rooney's got it. Wins it. Can he find a finish? Cleared away from immediate danger. Now cleverly. Well, what a chance. What a chance. I mean, they've been blessed to get away with that. Absolutely blessed. Carrick Milner surely a chance Abue with a great example of how to cover he's been dispossessed it's through to Drogba Smalling here's Rooney And he gives chase. On his own. Now cleverly. Abue is there to intercept. He's got possession now, maybe a chance. Here's Welbeck. It's opened up nicely for him. And a goal! They have a three-goal advantage, and that should be enough. Well, what can you say about that goal? No place, right time. We won't help them. I mean, with that much room, he didn't even need a controlling touch. He could just hit it first time. Too easy, way too easy. What a way to complete a hat-trick. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch and devastating in front of the goal. What a display. What a player.
so it's 3-0 now Drogba Yaya Toure a struggle to impose himself on this game it has to be said well he appears to be singled out here as the enemy number one and, and he's the one that they're looking to get to first and I think they think and they it's off the him, post they're probably going to stop the main threat so I think um, they've got to come up with a, a fresh idea to, to combat that Welbeck has robbed him surely he can't miss from here he's just drifted beyond the last defender Rooney on the ball. Tiote makes the interception. Cleverly. What can England do here? Yaya Toure. Tiote. Carrick. And Gerard. Rooney. Rooney shoots! Oh, that was a really good position. I think he's done very well to get into such a good position in front of the goal, but he just couldn't put in the telling touch. Rooney. Now through to Welbeck. Just the keeper to beat. Welbeck shoots. He's not taking any risks there. Could be a chance now. Real chance. Oh, yet another goal. They really have taken the apart now. thoughts on the goal Jim Begley yeah, I've got great admiration for the finish but I've even more admiration for the pass that set it up it was delicious he's made it an incredible four in this game They're well and truly out of sight now. The half-time whistle goes. At this stage, it's rather one-sided. So away we go then for the second half. Epoué. Yaya Toure. Welbeck is trying to go it alone Gerard, who has an assist to his name Rooney this is promising what can they make of it now the chance another chance another one and they escape imminent danger Now through to Rooney, Rooney just wasn't able to keep it down. I mean, when you're in front of the goal like that, you really should do better. That's a poor finish in the end. It's 
Drogba. Zakora. Carrick. And Rooney. Break is on. He did well to get it. What next? And Welbeck. Welbeck shoots. There it is. They're well clear now. It's just a question of how many more. It just couldn't have been placed any better. Yeah, it tempted and teased the keeper into thinking he could get to it, but it just eased the way to catch the inside of the post. A five-star performance from him here. this game in their hands now Zakora lunges wildly here's Rooney and surely he must score a chance can he shoot another goal Riveting, ruthless, relentless. Well, what can you say about that goal? It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't need them. They paid the price and deserved to. Drogba and Kalu Kalu now surely and that's gone wide at the left hand post yeah without the control to begin with he wouldn't have been able to get the top at goal but it was very nice technique for starters Glenn Johnson fouled there, no question about it. The referee shows him the yellow card, didn't go for the ball, just took the player out. Might consider himself a tad lucky not to see red. Zakora. He did well to get it. What next? Carrick has robbed him. Carrick! Gerard has teed up this corner. Got possession now, maybe a chance. Cleared away to safety. It's a throw in. So, from what I can see on the touchline, we're on the brink of a substitution. Well, if the deadlock is about to be broken, then it may well have to come from the bench. I mean, fresh legs when others are beginning to tire now could just do the trick. This game might just get a little stretched, it could help. Rooney. Looking to receive the ball, break could be on. He's trying his luck. <laughs> 
Zakora. Tiote. They need to be a bit more careful with their passing in this position. A really impressive run through. It's opened up nicely for him. Hello. Tiene will swing one in. Welbeck knocks it forward. No, no way through there. Epoué. They may well get a bit more joy down the flanks. They'll certainly find more space out there. And Yaya Toure. 75 minutes on the clock now. And suddenly the defence is on the back foot. Well, he was given the time and room initially to hold on to the ball, but eventually he was squeezed that bit harder. And another one! Clearly in no room just to sit on their lead. on the goal, Jim Beckley. Rooney has the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for him. A brace of goals for him now. Tiote. He couldn't get it cleanly, and it's a foul. And that is a yellow card. I think he knew it was coming too as soon as he went in for the tackle. To put him under pressure now. You just can't go around diving in for challenges like that. Players showing some concern for the man who's still down. Here is Drogba. Oh, well defended. Welbeck, who a few moments ago made his mark on this game. And that's been intercepted. Gerard, Neatly played. Welbeck really has the confidence and skill to be able to hold the ball up like that until support arrives a little sooner. There's maybe there, he overdid it slightly and should have released it because the support was arriving quickly. And he tries from long distance. Milner has got hold of Oh, he wasn't taking any chances there. Full time whistle within sight. Gets the ball in a nice position. Rooney shoots. Cleared away to safety. He's picked it up. Ashley Cole with Rooney Drogba gets the ball in a nice position can he now find a 
finish. Oh, he wasn't taking any chances there. Four additional minutes is being shown on the board. Gerard. Now cleverly. Drogba. He's going on. Drogba. Gerard. There's the final whistle. You could see their determination from the very start. A fabulous performance and one that will certainly delight the supporters. Well, how enjoyable was that? I love it when you get two teams giving it everything they've got. They held nothing back. Terrific stuff. And thanks to co-presenter Jim Beglin. And that brings to a close our coverage this afternoon.